you know the season that we had now it's summer <laughs> where if you put a bottle of water inside the car sometimes you know it's going to get extremely maybe light warm if you open you know if you open the bottle of water and put inside your mouth it's going to be warm so that is the season that we have now summer sometimes it can be extremely hot especially if you have a car that your seat is a leather it's going to be kind of hot but with this during summer you know it gets very cold too during summer if you hold your AC sometimes it will take few minutes or for the you know for the car to get cold if Kelly is not a by the time you you know turn on your car you just allow it's like let me just open the door for for the breeze you know for the heat to go out like let that be cross ventilation so that you will not be burning when you you know enter the car and sit down but during winter is vice versa very extremely cold but there are some states states that they are not you know cold like um, florida they are not cold and we have other states they are not cold like that but during the cold season if you put your water a bottle of water inside the car guess what you can you know but the next day the water can turn to ice cold that's why some people in a place in a state where there is you know winter and if they have a party a party is going on they will just take snow and put it inside the drinks so it make it to be kind of you know cold and not warm because here yeah, during cold we can still drink cold water or cold juice cold whatever but you can see that there's difference between them during one you need a jacket winter you need a jacket during the other you don't need a jacket one winter you have to dress as if you are going to go and fight snow you know you dress warm from your head to toe you keep warm that's why dressing warm you will see feel cold you will know that you are in the winter but summer can be extremely hot very very hot that it's like you don't want to put on clothes you want to go out naked go for bed my point is but during summer oh my goodness you will see the trees the leaves coming out green and beautiful in fact you can't even go outside you know you know to just set your camera you use it for thumbnail because the outside is green it's like the it leaves you know they are back but during winter you can't do that it's extremely dry then during fall you see the leaves you know fall it's like at least its name is you will see the leaves falling down from the tree where am I heading to but the Bible you know talks about the tree that is planted by the rivers of water Psalm 1 verse 3. The Bible says we shall be like a tree that is planted by the rivers of water that bring forth fruits in a season. Its leaves shall not wither, and whatsoever doeth shall prosper. You see, the tree that is planted by the water, they don't know season. They don't know the time that is called winter summer spring fall they don't know it because it's planted by the rivers of water and one of their characteristics of a tree that is planted by rivers of water they always flourish it's always kind of have this you know coolness in them very cool it's just like somebody that is always shining their body is not a dry, they don't have a dry skin. 
Even during winter, it's like oil on their faces everywhere. So you know that kind of, they don't know what is called dryness. Because the water is supplying everything that is needed for them. Even the sun and everything. So when it, Bible talks about the tree that is planted by, by the rivers of water, that means every aspect of our life, we are not going to know what is called dryness. The economy is this and that. We don't know because our supply chain that never run dry and we never run dry is Jesus. It's just like our father, you know, he has everything that we need to make life to be comfortable for us. He has it. So why should I suffer? Why should I be starved when I know that my heavenly father has everything that I really need to make life comfortable for me? So my prayer is, may we, despite the economy or there's no money outside, there is dryness, there is this, you know, and so on. May we never know what is called dryness. In every stages of our life, may that Psalm 1 verse 3 be our portion. We will always blossom, flourish. Whatever that is called lack is not going to be our portion. Even you that you are watching this video, my prayer is Psalm 1 verse 3. That tree that is so beautiful, you know, green. It's like, you know, forever green. Forever green. May we be our portion in the name of Jesus. May we keep on flourishing, you know, in every areas of our life in Jesus' name. Remember Psalm 3, Psalm 1, verse 3. Always remember that I, you that are watching me, you shall be like that tree that is planted by the rivers of water that bring forth fruit in a season, and whatsoever doeth shall prosper. May that be our portion in Jesus' name. Amen. And if you have not subscribed, please don't forget. It doesn't bite. It doesn't cost anything. By the time you, are, you subscribe or you like, you comment, in your own little way, you know, you are extending a hand of appreciation that, oh, thank you for doing this. So subscribe to the video, you know, share. And I pray that as you do, God bless you. Make sure you watch this video to the end because I'm going to show you this beautiful tree that... If it is during winter, you will be surprised that mm, how come that this tree is so dry, it's not, you know, looking good because the tree got affected by the weather, by what is, you know, happening around it. So may we not look like our problem. May we not look, you know, as if we don't have. But when you look at the other tree, you will see how beautiful that tree is. Very beautiful, you know, even from the top to the stem, looks so green and beautiful. You know one thing about green color? It's beautiful. So, look at that tree. It's just like the tree that the Bible talks about. Although the one I'm showing you is not planted by the river of water, but because of the season that we are in. So be the beauty of that tree and the leaves is hot. 
so you can easily see how beautiful it is how the weather too you know how this one got affected by the weather because it is summer so you know that's coolness although it's kind of hot god bless you bye for now